uh, the founder and the chairperson of uh, Megastars Football Club. This is a team that is found uh, in Kahawa, just behind Kenyatta University. And we are actually a new team, just started one year ago. We are taking part in the Nairobi East Sub-County League. And uh, we also are the winners for the uh, Cheza Dimba. It was uh, 250,000 that's just been given today. Because you get, uh, we travel as far as from KU to Kariobangi to Madare. And you get, uh, we have these players who we have to uh, carry. They are students, they are not working, they are not being paid. So it means uh, as the management, we have to make sure that their uh, transport is covered for some point they need to be uh, uh, be refreshed. Also, uh, they need to be motivated, right? We really thank Germany and Sport Pesa at large. They've really come along, they've really supported us, and I think this team is going to be a great ambassador the grassroots back in home and in the grassroots football. Yeah, versus the community team, and uh, currently we have about 30 players registered. Of course, we have management in place, and uh, it's a team that um, really within within the world that we come, we have actually three teams that are there. So you can imagine three teams coming from the same world competing in the regionals. That must be very tough. And so if you really can't prove yourself, then I think you, don't, you won't get yourself to this stage. And so it's a big team. We are currently, I think, sitting number three in the zone B of the regional uh, table, and the aim is actually to be at the top of that table and uh, play in the Division 2 come next season. Uh, but currently playing Division 1 in the Kenya Premier League. Uh, we have a team that has uh, small boys from 25 to 14 years that we are training. And with that age, imagine, we are still playing in the Division 1, eyeing for the Premier League next season. For basketball, we have a lot of challenges. For example, for our team, we can imagine we are like 42. So uh, in a day, we have like, let's say 30 people in, on the court. So we have to have so many balls. That's are some of the challenges. We have shoes that we play on the court. Our court uses a, a lot of rubber. So um, a month or two, if you are consistent on the court, you have no shoes. We have 30 million shillings for the whole year. But every month we'll be awarding uh, top winners for gold, silver, and bronze and ensuring that those talents are uploaded to your website and are identified. So that's the whole essence of GG. kind of talent you can upload onto the platform and then you can get an award. Because the whole objective of the platform is to identify talent. And then after identifying that talent, because Sport Pesa, we have the exposure. You can imagine you get someone from the grassroots who has no exposure. And Sport Pesa has that power to propel that talent to be seen everywhere countrywide. So that exposes even other sponsors. It doesn't have to be Sport Pesa alone, but it exposes that talent to countrywide sponsorship so that they can get the support that is required.